So guys, for the first step, you wanna to go to the web browser that you're having a problem. I'm assuming you're using Google Chrome. And then once you're on this, you wanna click on the three dots in the top right, and then click on settings. And now on the left hand side, you wanna click on privacy and security. Now you wanna scroll down again, and then click on site settings. And then once you're here, you wanna scroll down again, and then click on microphone. Make sure that you have your correct microphone selected. And then you wanna select, site can ask to use your microphone. Select this, and now you wanna scroll down. And then where it says not allowed to use your microphone, if you see Google Meet right here, then you wanna cancel that, you wanna take that off. You wanna take it off the list where it says not allowed to use your microphone. And now for the next step, you wanna head over to search and type in sound settings, click on it. And then once you're on this, you wanna scroll down and then click on more sound settings. And now you wanna click on the recording tab. And now you wanna find your microphone. You wanna make sure there's a default device. So you wanna click on it one time and then click on set default. And now the green tick will appear here. And now you wanna double click on your microphone. And then you wanna to go to levels. Make sure that you do not have it muted. You wanna unmute this and then you wanna turn this up. And then click on okay. And now for the next step, you wanna head over to search again and type in settings, click on it. And now once you're on this on the left hand side, you wanna click on privacy and security. Now you wanna scroll down till you find microphone, click on this. Make sure you have microphone access turned on. You wanna scroll down. If you see Google Meet right here, you wanna turn that on for that as well. And you also wanna make sure that you have your correct microphone selected on Google Meet. And then once you complete all the steps in the video, you just wanna restart your computer and then the problem should be fixed.